room for improvement and there's a void in Western medicine. <clears throat> you could use those uh, ADD, ADHD drugs. I don't know it's any better. You can use those, uh, you know, you know, medicine to increase serotonin, increase the, increase the epinephrine, no epinephrine. But I always say that we don't really know what's going on in the brain. We know there are about seven major neurotransmitters. We know there are probably 50 chemical chemical messenger in the brain. But for any given patient sitting in front of me, I don't know whether she needs more serotonin or more dopamine or more epinephrine. I really don't. I, I don't know how much either. But I only know, and this is what my ancestors said, I'm relating to you. My ancestors said 2,000 years ago. Maybe 2,000 years later, scientists will come up with a lot of neurochemicals, <laughs> neurotransmitters called dopamine, norepinephrine, acetylcholine, those kind of things. We don't care. We only know one thing. We supply the blood to the brain. The brain is the factory. The brain knows what to make. The brain is capable, based on the genetic coding, okay, or genetic codes, brain know how much neurotransmitters to make in what quantity at exactly the right time. So our job as a TCM practitioner is improve the blood flow. Treat the heart, treat the brain, and I also give them herbs. Most of them have the weak left the chun, okay? But again, you have to verify. Vary your, uh, uh, vary and to pers personalize your your TCM herbal formulation a little bit. So I use a lot of yuan zi, dang sen, shi san pu, jue pu zu yi tang, sometimes you add a dang gui, chun, chung, as a blood opener. And if you're too weak, you also add, uh, you also add a, or whatever else, your blood pressure is low. It works. It does work. I've treated many, okay?